Assalamu alaikum dear student how are you all i hope you are all well by the grace of almighty allah welcome to nieds home school i am nasim akhtar assistant teacher of science national idol english version school morning shift today i am going to take a general science class for class 2 student so let's start today's class dear student our topic is safety this is chapter 7 in your book and this is class number 3 accident can happen anywhere if you are not careful to be safe from accident we should always be careful in everything we do carelessness is the main cause of accidents staying away from hurt and injury is called safety The rules that we follow to remain safe are called safety rules. Now we will learn what is safety rules. Keeping safe at home. We can have accidents while at home. To be safe at home, you may follow the following safety rules. One number rule is do not play with matchsticks, crackers or fire. If you do this, you can burn yourself. Two number option is do not play with sharp objects blade knife or scissors you can cut yourself you can see this picture this girl cut her finger number 3 point is do not touch plug point and sockets with wet hands you can get an electric shock four four number point is be careful while handling electrical appliances you can hurt yourself you can see this picture this boy is uh, ironing her clothes with the help of elders five number point is do not play inside the kitchen or go near burning stove you may burn yourself okay next topic is keeping safe on road to be safe on the road you may follow the following safety rules first is always walk on the footpath next is if there is no footpath always keep to the left next is do not play on the road last one always use the zebra crossing to cross the road the black and white lines printed on the road is called the zebra crossing next point is follow the traffic light before crossing the road and after that do not cross when traffic signal is red and then use the over bridge you can see here is a picture they are using zebra crossing to be safe at school you should follow the following safety rules always walk in a queue do not run in the corridors or stairs do not push or pull anyone do not fight with others wait for your turn to play next topic is keeping safe inside a moving vehicle to be safe inside a moving vehicle you should follow the following safety rules always use a seat belt while sitting inside a moving car you can see here is the picture this baby using a, his seat belt use a helmet while riding or bike or scooter do not jump and play inside a moving vehicle you may fall do not get in and out of a moving vehicle next is being careful with stranger a stranger is a person you do not know you should always be careful from strangers sometimes they may try to hurt you you can be careful from strangers in the following ways do not talk to stranger while going to school never open the door to people you do not know do not accept gift from unknown person and do not 
talk to unknown person over the telephone okay you can see this picture here is a stranger do not talk to stranger while going to school hmm. and then never open the door for unknown person and do not accept gift from stranger student now we will do some exercise exercise based on this chapter first is tick the correct answer one number always work on these option is zebra crossing footpath and both answer is a number option zebra crossing two number is do not play with a number option toys knife c number is ball our answer is knife because this is sharp things you will cut your finger with this three number while riding a bike wear a a number option gloves b number google goggle and c number helmet our answer is c number helmet fill in the blanks one number is do not talk to dash answer is do not talk to strangers two number the black and white line on the road is dash answer is zebra crossing our three number is fill in the blank is be careful while handling dash electrical appliances our answer is electrical appliances and number four fill in the blank is accepting dash from unknown people can be dangerous answer is accepting gifts from unknown people can be dangerous now write true or false one number is play on the road no we do we should not play on the road so this statement is false we will write here false two number is follow the traffic lights yes we should follow the traffic lights so this statement is true we will write here true now one word answer question answer what is the question what is the main cause of accident answer will be carelessness and now answer the following questions what are safety rule answer will be to be safe at home we have to follow the following safety rules one number is do not play with match sticks or fire two number do not play with sharp objects three number do not touch plug points and sockets with wet hands four number do not play inside the kitchen or go near burning stove student now we will do a matching we will match from column a to column b column b our first uh, option is use a this will match with c over bridge we will match with one number is c and we will write a 1 plus c use a plus over bridge and two number is at school it will match with d do not stand on the desk so we will write here 2 plus d at school plus at first we will match this plus do not stand on the desk number 3 in the kitchen do not it will match with e number do not go near burning stove 3 plus e in the kitchen kitchen plus do not go near burning stove and 
Fourth number is in a moving vehicle. Do not jump. It will match with A number. That means 4 plus A in a moving vehicle plus do not jump. Jump. And the last one on the road it will match with B number. On the road follow the traffic lights. 5 plus B on the road plus follow the traffic lights. So that's it. Dear student, your SW will be your SW is true false true false and question answer that means these two true false and this question answer what are the safety rules so dear student i hope you have understood today's topic keep practice at home and do your assign sw in your sw copy and submit your sw every sunday from 8 am to 4 pm so i hope you will do this and submit this properly and see you again Thank you.